It has not been for nothing. Did you see the guy who owns the house? No, you know, I heard he never leaves the East Wing. You know, I heard he had an accident. Yeah, that he's disfigured. He has to Mr. Wear... Till, why are your people using the main staircase? And where's Mrs. Bolton? Uh, she's at the bar, so can I help? The East drawing room. Unlock the door, put the tray on the table, lock the door again. Nothing more. I'm sorry, Miss Tate, I tried, but he won't see you. And you know, you mustn't take it personally. Everyone knows that Wayne's holed up in there with eight-inch nails, peeing into mason jars. It's very good of you to let me on the ground. Why are you wasting your time trying to talk to a man who threw away your investment on some save-the-world vanity project? He can't get your money back. I can. I could try explaining that a save-the-world project, vain or not, is worth investing in, Mr. Daggett. But you understand only money and the power you think it buys. So why waste my time, indeed? Second shift reports in. You should spend some more time with the mayor. Well, that's your department. Anyone shown him the crime stats? He goes by his gut, and it continues to bother him no matter what the numbers. He must be popular with his wife. Not really. She took the kids and left for Cleveland. I have plenty of time for visits. The mayor's going to dump him in the spring. Really? Mm-hmm. But he's a hero. A war hero. This is peacetime. Mr. Wayne, isn't it? Although you don't have the long nails or the, the, the facial scars, sir. What would they say about me? It's just that no, no one ever sees you. That's a beautiful necklace. Reminds me of one that belonged to my mother. It can't be the same one. Because her pearls are in this safe. Manufacturer clearly explained is uncrackable. Oops. Nobody told me it was uncrackable. I'm afraid I can't let you take those. Look, you wouldn't beat up a woman any more than I would beat up a cripple. Of course, sometimes exceptions have to be made. Good night, Mr. Wayne. Can I have a ride? You read my mind. Let's go. Miss Tate was asking to see you again. She's very persistent. And quite lovely. In case you were wondering. Wasn't? What are you doing? Examining print dust. We've been robbed. And this is your idea of uh, sounding the alarm, is it? She took the pearls, tracking device and all. She? One of the maids. Perhaps you should stop letting them in this side of the house. Perhaps you should start learning to make your own bed. Why were you dusting for prints? I wasn't. She was. Sir. Yeah, Congressman Gilly's wife has been calling in. Apparently, the congressman never made it home after the Wayne Foundation event. 